June 28, 1994. On the left in this video, a French colonel. On the right, one of his subordinates speaking to him. He warns him about the killing of thousands of Tutsis in a nearby village in the Bicicero Hills in the west of the country. Yesterday we were in this village. I don't remember the name. People were hunting for Tutsis across the hills. There were houses burning everywhere and people carried around pieces of torn flesh. These killings marked the beginning of one of the bloodiest massacres of the Rwandan genocide. More than 16,000 Tutsis were killed in the Bicicero Hills by the Rwandan army and pro-government militias. In this video released by French news outlet Mediapart on Thursday, the French colonel, however, fails to appreciate the urgency of the situation. The problem is that they have no one to turn to for help. They're covered in infected wounds. <laughs> Mediapart reveals that the French colonel was questioned about this video by a French judge in 2015. He told the judge he was absent-minded at the time, unable to understand what was going on. It's true that looking back at this scene, it seems incredible to me that I did not react to this information. A judicial inquiry was launched in 2005 to shed light on France's role in the Bicicero massacre. Human rights groups say France knowingly failed to prevent it, but the French military insists it didn't know about the killings until the 30th of June, two days after the video was shot. The case was dismissed in September due to a lack of evidence. No charges have been brought against any French soldiers.